So, without understanding what is the duty of human being, because he is fallen, so we should not bother for maintaining our family and children till the time of death. No. Up to twenty-five years. A brahmachari is trained to refrain from sex life. That is brahmachari, celibacy. But if he is still not able, then he is allowed to accept grihastha life. There is no cheating, hypocrisy. That I proclaim myself as brahmachari or sannyasi and I secretly do all nonsense. This is hypocrisy. The hypocrisy life will not make man advance in spiritual life. That is the example given by Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. His personal associates, you know, Chattva Haridas, Junior Haridas. He was a very nice singer. So Chaitanya, he was singing in the assembly of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And one day he went to bake some rice from Siti Maitri's sister, and there was a young woman, and he lustfully saw them. That is sometimes natural. But Kirtan Mahaku understand that just to teach us while he was eating. He said, Who brought this rice? Uh, so ask him not to see me anymore. Finish. Everyone was surprised. What happened? Uh, then by inquiry it was found uh, that he lustfully saw one young woman. That this Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is so strict that uh, he rejected him from his associates. Then other big, big devotees requested him that he has committed some mistake. And please excuse him, he is your servant. And Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said, All right, then you bring them, bring him back, you live with them, I am leaving this place. I am leaving this place. Oh, then he said, No, sir, we shall not raise this question anymore. So when the Chaitanya does, found it impossible to again go into the assembly of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He found it uh, hopelessness. Then he went to Triveni and committed suicide. The Chaitanya Mahaprabhu knows everything. Then sometimes after he inquired, uh, <coughs> what about Chaitanya Haridas? Uh, somebody said, Have you rejected him? Out of disappointment, he has committed suicide. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Let's see how stiff. That's nice. He never expected any, any sympathy. Oh, I rejected this person and he has committed suicide. Oh. No, he said, Oh, that's nice. That's all right. He said, right. This is one thing. Another thing, uh, <coughs> Sivananda, one of his very exalted devotees, he was taking care of all devotees who were coming to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu to visit during Rasa Yatra. So his wife came and offered Chaitanya Mahaprabhu his senses, and he saw that the wife is pregnant. <clears throat> so immediately asked Sivaranda, your wife is pregnant? Yes. All right. 
when he see this bath the child, he keep his name like that. Now see, one man simply saw with lusty desire to a young man, he was rejected. And one man has uh, his wife pregnant, he, he adored him, that's all right. So sex life is not forbidden in this moment, but hypocrisy is forbidden. They do become hypocrite, then there is no way. That is state of mind. Chhota Hari Das, he presented himself as a brahmachari and he was looking after a young woman. Then he understood, he is a hypocrite, rejected. And Sivaranga said, he was Diyastha, Diyastha must have seen that, but he is not there. He said, yes. My Remnants of food should be given. This is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's movement. So our request is don't be hypocrite. Uh, there are four ashramas Brahmachari, Grihastha, Banaprastha, Sunland. Whichever ashrama is suitable for you, you accept. But sincere, don't be hypocrite. If you think, that you want sex only to marry and remain like a gentleman, <coughs> don't be hypocrite. Uh, this is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's name. Uh, he uh, did not like hypocrisy. Nobody likes. Uh, but uh, for a person who is seriously uh, engaged in Krishna consciousness, Moment. For him, uh, sex life and material opulence is not very good. Uh, that is taken the Mahaprabhu opinion. Param param jigimisho bhavo niskin chanasa bhajaran mukhasa. Param param, therefore, voluntarily taken the Mahaprabhu accepted sannyas. Uh, he was very nicely situated in his family life. Uh, when he was family man, he married twice. One wife died, he married again. Uh, so, the Chaitanya Mahaprabhu taught us not to become. But when he took some land, he was very, very strict. Uh, no man could come very near to him uh, from distance. This is Chaitanya Mahavu's teaching. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama. Rama.